Hi guys, it's Ann over at Plan Obsessed, and today we're going to be doing a unboxing slash demonstration of our new shredder that I have been using, we have been using, for making the bedding for the worm composting. So here is my husband, and he's going to tell you what kind of shredder we got, and then show you what we put through it. This is an Aurora. It's an 18-page shredder. Model number AU1800XA. And it will shred like nobody's business. So can you show them the drawer? Oh, I can show you the drawer right here. Look. And it's big. Yeah, that's... It's deep. It's more than a five-gallon bucket when it's shredded up. All right, so... And this will not run if you do not have that drawer. So that's a safety fast. feature, so you, nobody puts their fingers it's in it. safety feature, yes, correct. Okay, the pugs are listening carefully because they're going to use this later. All right, so what kind of stuff do we have to shred today? Uh oh, my favorite, bills. We're going to shred bills. If, is it on? Oh, it's a, uh, there, it's a, I had it on an auto. I must have subbed it when I brought it out here. It's really, a, it's a lot quieter than our old one, isn't it? Much quieter. Okay, now what are we doing, a cereal box or oh something? Oh yeah, this is one of those heavy duty granola boxes. You know, they're always heavy because the cereal is heavy. It doesn't seem to be making any more noise than it did with the bills. No. Now I'm going to show you how it does with two pieces of uh, cereal box. Of the scene. Double thickness of cereal double box. Thickness. So it does appear to strain a little bit, a strain, yeah, but, but it, it's, chew it, up. it is still chewing it up. Mm -hmm. So what else have you got in there to shred? Oh, we got uh, mailers. Those are always fun to shred. So those I check and make sure there's no plastic or cards or anything. But if you were going to use this for regular household use, you could actually shred credit cards. This is a piece of lasagna. No, that is a pizza box. I know, I'm shredding my future lasagna. Yeah, her lasagna. So this is oh, ye old pizza box. Yes. Oh, yeah, that is. Look at that thing, though. Oh, there's another piece. Didn't have any Amazon boxes, oddly enough, so we're going to have to... Oh. There uh, is one little contention with this. There. Did you turn it off by accident? No. Why did it stop? I'll, I'll explain that in just a second. Now, when you have this on auto, you have to feed between the first and the last dot. If okay. it's offset at all, it will shut itself down because the sensor it doesn't see is it. located in between these two right here. So that was offset a little bit, so this sensor kicked it off. So if you have an uneven piece, you need to make sure you're starting in the middle. Yes. More granola box. Ooh, Ta-da! All right, let's see what we got. Open the drawer. Okay. So then there we have, there we have it. It's not as small of a cut as my old one, but then again, my old one did not blow through pizza boxes. So there we have it. Uh, there's a pizza box, four cereal boxes, random other things. Coke cases. Coke, or yeah, Coke cases and other things. And cases. that is what we get. All right, guys. Well, this is our review for the Aurora AU1800XA. 
and it is an 18 sheet maximum and it has reverse and so far so good we've had it for a month or two and it will eat credit cards yes but we're not going to give credit cards to the worms no they charge enough as it is right so anywho if you like the video give it a thumbs up and if you're not already a member of my family click that subscribe button and if you want to know what I'm doing when I'm doing it ring that little bell icon alright guys thanks for hanging out with me and my worm equipment and everybody have a good day